Hi, it's Richard Marker at the Wise Philanthropy Channel once again. This is a project of the Institute for Wise Philanthropy. I was recently asked to present a webinar for a group of wealth advisors, philanthropy advisors, and trust and estate attorneys uh, on, the, on the issue of diversity, equity, and inclusion. Now, for some of you, that may not be uh, so obvious why they've asked me, but anyone who's taken a course with me over the last 18 years is fully aware of how committed I have been to address the issue of equity in, uh, in, in my teaching. After all, uh, one of the, the, the issues that any of us in the philanthropy world are well aware of is that we play a key role in defining what our entire sector looks like, the nonprofit sector, the grant making sector. And if we don't have a sensitivity to how equity really works, then we're never going to be able to address the currently popular term DEI, diversity, equity, and inclusion. And so that as we formulated that upcoming webinar, and I'm happy to tell you more about that when we get closer to it, uh, it became clear that long before we can address the issue of, uh, of DEI, either in terms of sensitivity or in terms of statistics, metrics, we have to go deeper and to understand what the workplace looks like, how, how professionals and staff are treated, how they're rewarded, uh, how they're encouraged, what kind of relationship they need to have with those who are enabling and those who are working uh, side by side with them. Uh, and so um, what I'm going to do now after, after this present, after this introduction is present a series of vignettes of proven successful models of how one develops a successful workplace, a successful relationship with, with uh, boards of directors uh, and, uh, and builds the underlying issues of equity into our work as funders in the nonprofit sector, and by extension to those who work in the for-profit sector as well. So stay tuned. We're going to be uh, giving you very practical advice uh, in, uh, in, in the next series of, of uh, vlogs. Uh, thanks very much for joining me today. I look forward to hearing your comments and re responses uh, to these series of presentations, uh, and I hope that they prove useful to you. Thanks very much.